Hey fams, it's Heyman. Today, I just wanted to pop in and share with you three simple habits that I do to check in with myself, especially when things get hectic in the studio. I hope that sharing these three habits can provide some comfort and some encouragement for you to check in and take care of yourself in the midst of all your hustle and bustle and creative adventures. So I call these three habits three Ps. I leaned on them a lot when things got really hectic this year. I started to work with brands that I really love, Teenage Engineering, Spitfire Audio, Plastic Cell, while trying to make sure that I'm putting out my weekly videos for you to watch. And I know that when we have deadlines and workloads, the last thing we do is check in on ourselves. So I hope this... <laughs> So I hope these three habits will be of good use to you. Habit number one, P1, purge all thoughts before you get into the studio. I learned the art of morning pages through Julia Cameron's book, The Artist's Way. Morning pages is basically just purging all your thoughts into three full pages and whatever comes to mind, just write it down. If nothing comes to mind and all you can think of is nothing comes to mind, just write that. Nothing comes to mind right now, um, not feeling anything or I'm feeling very stressed, don't know why I'm stressed, just put that down. Doing morning pages almost every day for a couple of years now, it's easier for me to relay to myself like what I'm feeling because sometimes I'm just so blocked. I'm just thinking of what I need to do next. I don't even know how I'm feeling. The morning pages help me connect with myself, feel a little bit lighter before my session, get a lot of stuff off my chest. Yeah, I hope that you'll try morning pages, you'll try purging all of your thoughts onto three full pages and just see how it goes, you know? P2. Habit number two is pause. Pause. Pause for perspective. When I'm hustling and when I'm working and when I'm on serious deadlines, I can just sit on this desk from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. The eyes get so dry. And there were times that I just didn't even move. And by the end of the week, I just feel like my whole body is just like a biscuit, like I'm the gingerbread man or something. And if I move my arm, I'll just snap. If I just paused more often, I'd feel so much better. And I know during the hustle and during deadlines, it's really hard to just stop, pause, eat, take care of ourselves, drink water. That's why I make it a habit to put my drinks away from the table. The minute I feel thirsty, I just have to get up and leave this desk. Just breaking eye contact with Ableton, my desk, especially when the project's not going well and you feel like, oh, this song is just getting worse. Oh no, I, I think I would just want to dump this entire track and start fresh. Just pause, take a sip of water, relax a little bit, allow yourself some new perspective. And then when you come back to your desk, you'll feel much better. Habit number three, P3, is play. I think this is something that I forget really often. Music becomes work, deadlines, goals, and so many things that get so murky when you're trying to hustle and make music your thing. At the end of the day, if you don't play, then you can't really create and you can't really make content or music or things that you absolutely love that sparks so much happiness and joy in you. Always remember to set aside some time, even if it's just five to 10 minutes, just play music, not think, just play. I'm going to leave you with a track that I was just playing. It's just playtime for me. I don't know where the track is going. And uh, I hope, as always, this piece brings you peace. If you have any simple habits that you would love to share with me, please leave it in the comment section. Be very happy mentally, physically, and peaceful. Bye, fans. See you on the next video.